action. In theory, we all could be gay. That's wow. that's how <laughs> it starts. That's how it starts. <laughs> Is this balls? Listen. Is that your balls? If Is you it... want them to be. Hey, 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 hey. That's a wife of that's heavy. Put your, put your thumb in there. Nope. Come on now. Put your thumb what Future said? Put your thumb put in his butt. Thumb in there. Yeah. Like at, at this point in time, you got to realize it's something you're born with. Yeah. And there's nothing wrong with it. Yeah. So what's the problem? I'm wondering why straight men like Joe Rogan, Charlemagne the God, and Andrew Schultz, why are these men playing gay games and pushing a homosexual agenda? I don't even understand it. I thought Rogan was one of the last of the great freedom fighters. His platform was pushing masculinity, men being strong, going hunting, fighting, just doing masculine stuff. And now it's also stupid. Yeah. Like at, at this point in time, you got to realize it's something you're born with. Yeah. Yeah. I'm like, hey, Joe, what are you talking about, brother? But then you have a guy like Charlemagne the God. In theory, we all could be gay. And that's wow. that's <laughs> how it starts. <laughs> that's how it starts. What kind of theory is that? If you were to have a civilization that was all homosexuals in a hundred years, there would no longer be a civilization. Everybody would be dead because there'll be no babies. That's a fact. They're pushing this stuff right down our throats. I don't believe that. My poor little children will one day live in a nation where they will not be judged by the color of their skin, but by the content of their character. I have a dream today. He said, judge me based on the content of my character, not based on my sexual activity. He didn't say that. But when you judge a person based on the content of their character, I want to know what your ideas are. It's not gay. Let me do that to you see how you Go ahead. Get, from, get behind me. <laughs> do like, do, let's do all the poses. Right, right, right. All right, do the first one. <laughs> she, yo, that I look feel, wild. I Put your hand on my heart. Right there. Right there. Okay. Now, bro, you now, look, now come heart, here, come bro. here. Look, look. You I don't, don't want to touch yeah. this fucking gel. Yeah. No, no. This is, I think I'm holding you like this. Yeah. Oh, my God. These comedians are pushing this anti human ideology, and I'm wondering what's the joke? What's the punchline? Why are two men who are married, why are y'all over there holding each other? I no longer want to participate in any media that's promoting a homosexual ideology. I don't want to see it. I'm asking every straight person in America, every heterosexual person, once you start seeing some homosexual activity on TV, just turn it off. Why is Andrew Schultz playing like that? Why is Charlamagne the God playing like that? Why is Joe Rogan talking about that? Joe Rogan, Charlamagne the God, Andrew Schultz, all of these men are social cucks. They tune their booties up in the air and they let the LGBTQ community just run a train on them, all of them. What well, Future said, put your thumb in his butt. In well, not his butt, but. I gotta lick it? If you feel like no, it, I don't know. I am not putting my thumb in your butt. They are surrendering their identity and their platform to someone else's ideas. That's why I call them a cup. And so I think that I should uplift women. I think women should uplift men and we should work together, be friends, have babies, and, and just stop all this craziness. How did it feel? How did it feel when I was holding you, bro? It you're felt normal. It. Gay is normal. It didn't feel crazy. Gay to is me. normal. Hey, let's play gay. It's so funny. I'm like, go well, away, man. The, the things that we give attention to, it gives those things value. And I'm no longer giving attention to things that I don't believe in. That's dead. Joe Rogan, Andrew Schultz, Charlemagne the God, they're using their platform to promote death. And when these guys have big platforms like that, they are social leaders. They are media leaders. And they're leading us to anti-human ideology, to death and destruction, to the end of America. The greatest American alive. The greatest American alive. The greatest American alive. The greatest American alive. The greatest American alive.